Hello everybody, Rico here and my wife, and uh, right now we are at the Cherokee Casino in Roland, and we're at the hotel, and uh, Amanda magically got a voucher for a free night and food, and $50 of free play, and we've already ate, and it was really, really good. It was really good. It was really good, um, and... It's really nice. Like, it's really nice. In the hotel, at the buffet, and the room. And we'll give you a tour of the room just here shortly. But uh, to start off, dinner uh, really wasn't that expensive. I mean, if we would have bought it, it would have been like 25 bucks. Mm -hmm. But um, the, uh, the food that was there was all really good. If you don't do anything when you come here, at least try the fajita meat. Because that was pretty stellar. Yes, but, uh, they have a wide variety. Yeah, and everything was pretty painless, even when we checked in. Like, the people there were cool and nice and uh, pleasant, and we didn't have to do a whole lot. No. Nope. Just get our bags and come in. So, uh, anyway, as it stands right now, Cherokee would get five stars out of five for me. So far, so good. Yeah, and not everybody that comes in looks like a meth head either, and it doesn't reek like cigarettes. It so. actually smells really good, which is really surprising because there are smokers down there, but you can't even tell. Yeah. Nope. Can't can't tell. So anyway, we're gonna give you a tour of the room and I guess a little bit of outside. I don't know if they'll let us record. I'm sure they won't let us record downstairs, but maybe maybe the outside. But anyway, we'll show you the room. Okay, everybody. This is uh walking into the room. And we have a little, what would you call this, like an armoire, a desk, I don't know. But we've already got our shit strung everywhere. And uh, we've got some drawers there. Pretty nice TV. Have one almost just like it, but uh, over here we got a, what would you call it, like a vanity mirror? Uh -huh. So the ladies can get pretty. Uh, I guess a hotel phone. And a mini fridge, which is awesome right now, because we brought some stuff from home. <laughs> so, uh, just a big, big window looking outside, and nice little chair, the bed, and the headboard, which is huge, and the lamps. But the cool thing about the lamps. Because everything moving forward. It has a little USB plug right there. And a cordless phone. But either way, the room's really nice and it was really clean. And it smelled clean. And what else? Well, I mean, we're going to go in the bathroom here in a minute, but everything was like, everything's been nice. That's what we, that's what we keep saying. Like, there's another local casino called Choctaw out of Bacola, and it's pretty poopy compared to this. Yeah, this is this is pretty baller. So, y'all are really going to like this. Anyway, this is the shower, and that has a bad reflection of me. <laughs> hey, y'all got to see me in the shower. Like, that was a hologram. Anyway, that's a nice sitting spot. Just sit and chill. But it's all tile. And it will easily fit two people. And then, swing around here without making everybody dizzy. To the sink. And the mirror. Which the mirror has these cool little lights right there. So that's pretty, that's pretty sweet. But everything's so tidy. Like everything was really tidy and put away. And there's a bathroom mat. And a little little toilet. Little toiletries. And that's really that's really it. Mm-hmm. Just enough 
to go spend some money at the casino, which, as we said before, we didn't pay for. Um, they uh, they gave her fifty dollars in free play, and we brought a little bit of our own money. We don't spend a whole lot at the casino, but anyway, we're gonna Have go. To go gamble. Yeah, we're gonna go gamble a little bit, and if I can get a couple shots of the outside, I will too, because it's all it's all new and really nice, and the rooms seem to be. Pretty nice and a little bit ahead of their time, so maybe they'll they won't have to keep updating it. So anyway, uh, we're gonna go have some fun. Yeah. See ya. So after spending the whole night at the Cherokee Casino in Roland, um, I come to a couple conclusions. First and foremost, to start with, uh, when you walk through the front door and you go in to meet the receptionist or whatever you want to call her. Everybody was super friendly, super nice, was clean. It didn't smell like cigarettes, which is a big plus because the other local casino, Choctaw, smells like cigarettes as soon as you come in the front door. So we did all of our stuff, got our room, and all of it was super smooth. Then we went on down to the buffet, um, Went and got our plates, got seated, uh, the waitresses took care of us, and the food there was pretty good. Um, they had a wide selection of food from Asian to comfort food, which is like your fried chicken and, and roasts, uh, to Mexican, and everything in between, dessert, tons of dessert. If you go just for the food, you won't be disappointed. Uh, like I said, ev everything was good. So that brings me to the actual hotel room. And the hotel room itself, we were really surprised whenever we first walked in because I, I don't know what I expected, but it was done really well. Uh, the color schemes were, were good. It smelt good, like it was clean. The bathroom was awesome. And the bed, I mean, it's a, it's a hotel bed, so you can't really expect a whole lot out of that. Um, the gaming floor leaves a little bit to be desired like the other casino the local one is a lot bigger i guess in terms of gaming floor space so it leaves a little bit to be wanted to be desired um we played a heck of a lot longer on the the 50 dollars my wife got comped and then we added 40 bucks to that. We we played for hours and hours. Uh, I don't think we went up to the room till about 2.30 in the morning. And we started gaming at about 8. So we had plenty of fun. Security was doing their job. Um, I actually saw them ask a couple people to leave. And that made us feel good. Uh, only because they were doing their job. And then from there... The people in general, like the general public, it wasn't full of crackheads. Like, there was one person that we saw that you could tell they 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 might have been, you know, doing some nefarious activities before they came. But generally, everybody we come in contact with was was really nice and clean and was there to have a good time, not there just to you know try and win back their dope money. So all in all. The Cherokee Casino in Roland is, was a really good experience, is a good experience. Um, if you look online, you're going to see all sorts of bad reviews, and I don't know why. I don't, I, don't, I don't know if I'm just easily entertained or because I was just expecting a good time and I had a good time, but we enjoyed it. I would recommend it if you're coming through Roland, even just to stay for the night, you know, throw a few bucks in the machine. You'll, you'll enjoy yourself. Uh, everything is clean and everybody is nice so the food is good too and uh, I guess I'm going to leave you with that and once again this is Rico6801 and uh, thanks for checking it out peace